And welcome back! So, um, can't really remember what we did last time, and actually, to be honest, this is actually post recording because Audacity messed up and deleted the original files for this, so, whatever. It's kind of cloudy today, um. Thinking about what we should do, though, um. Yeah, so, um, I feel bad for those little crops, because they're not going to get to grow. Yeah, we can't exactly reach them. I want to get my watering can to at least silver by fall, because come fall we're going to have to deal with a lot of crops. And then winter we don't have to deal with any, and we mostly mining. So you'll notice that that one plant right there is growing a little slower. Um, the reason for that is the soil quality. The darker the soil, the better quality it generally is. That's the way of putting it. Eh, oh well. So what are my goals for this season? Um, to think. Jamie beat us. No. Darn you, Jamie. Uh, okay, and then there's the Moonlight Cave, I don't care. Oh, goals. They're okay. So, we're going to try to build up our barn and get our first cow before the end of spring, because... I don't know. It's helpful. It's a lot more money, and you guys will appreciate what I do with cows. No. Not that, you sick curries. You know who you are and what you were thinking. Don't try to deny it. But I generally name my cows after... <sighs> what are they called? Oh, female characters in the Tales of series, so like... We had Mila from Zillia, I once had Estelle from Vesperia, and... Yeah. Take your bet on the which one we'll actually name first. <laughs> and so, there's some of you that are going to be fixating on that whole worry thing. First off, welcome to the channel. My name is Sir Clud. Get used to that. Second, internet, you're scary sometimes. Like, seriously. Scary. I can't even look up information on Zero Suit Samus in the new Smash Bros. game because you're scary. You're great sometimes, but scary. Actually, truth be told, half the reason we go to bed at 6 is this guy doesn't have any access to video games or internet? Oh, what's he supposed to do in his life with add those things? And that's why we sleep literally more than half the day. Yep. Yep, yep. Ugh. So this area we're coming to up here actually has something of interest. Um, there's a cave which you can enter, it's not like a mine, but you can actually climb, go rock climbing and the point is to get to the mountain top. There's some interesting things up on the mountain. I, it'll be important to the plot later on when we actually get there. If we ever get there. And yeah. So we're gonna just try selling honey. Turns out it sells for more than I thought. Yeah, it surprised me too, I'm not gonna lie. To be honest, it actually sells for more than purple herbs. And this guy needs to work out. <coughs> he walks slow as heck carrying honey. One single jar of honey, I mean. Okay, granted that jar looks about as big as 
one when he would get his head stuck in, but come on. Come on. Don't press the X button. Don't press the X button. Don't press the X button. Don't push the X button. We can do it. We can make it. Almost there. Almost there. Almost there. And shipped. Hundred. 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 Okay. Oh. No, we're not gonna smash the box. But we are going to switch the hammer out for the axe. We can actually start chopping wood and get the pieces of wood we need for the barn. I'm trying to think of how many pieces we need. We'll, we'll visit Woody later and he'll tell us. Um, yeah, let's go look for some wood. We're going to chop that wood. Chopping wood, chopping wood, chopping, chopping, chopping wood. Yeah, we'll move faster if I put the axe away. This guy has problems. Okay, I guess technically the axe is made out of salt. Wait, 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 wait. Why would you move faster if you put it in your pockets than if you're just carrying it? It weighs the same either way. The hell? So, let me get this straight. You can carry an axe, a hammer, a watering can, and a bunch of stuff in your pockets, but the split second you have to carry a leaf in your hands becomes too much. What? That? Okay, that's logic for you. Oh well. So an interesting trivia effect, I actually remade this game for the Wii, but in a way it was kind of a downgrade just because I cut out the female character you can play as and gave it a crappy control scheme. I might actually get the Wii version one day just to play it, but who knows? So one... Thing I will say about this game, though, I don't want 100% for a few reasons. And that's why we're not getting all the notes. Um, for one thing, you have to get to the bottom of both mines, and getting to the bottom of both mines can be a dick. So, first, it's pretty much random which holes to take you down and which ones will push you back up. It can get obnoxious. I've never actually made it to the bottom of either one, and I've tried a lot. And then in the lake one, especially, it's possible to get stuck. Just because... Well... If you run into a floor that's invisible at 5, so like 5, 10, 15, 20, whatever. Um... You won't have anything that can go down or up. Okay, so we have... Spring Horse Race, Flower Festival... Yeah, so the 22nd we need to go ship flowers, okay. Cow festival. We'll try to have a cow by then. But getting to the bottom of the mines, yeah, once you run into a dead end, you have to go back up and it doesn't matter how far you are, it will just screw you over. It's not nice. No, we weren't trying to open you, Mr. Cupboard. We wanted to pick up Hank. And I swear I did not think of the name Hank being our next door neighbor when I named a dog. I was thinking Tomo 9 is Let's Play. The Sims or is it the Sims Blasting out his playing? Yeah it is, okay. He hasn't updated in a few days. I think he went to some whatever. I don't know. Could most likely start playing this game soon though, so. This or a wonderful life. I recommend going and checking out both. And if I can only water correctly. Yeah. Don't drink and play games, kids. I'm not drunk, but... 
currently drinking Mountain Dew. Don't drink Mountain Dew and play video games. It makes it so you can't aim your watering can. Okay, then I am going, what the hell is that one? Yeah, those three middle crops are gonna die pretty soon here. Oh, well, it sucks for them. And off we go for our morning routine. Get used to this, this is gonna be a thing of beauty. And you all love it. You know you do. Do, 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 do. Let's see here. Okay. What's going on? Can't tell if my computer's being drunk. Okay, apparently we're just gonna keep going. So there's that. Um. Yeah, if audio goes weird a few seconds ago, just ignore that. My computer just decided to do a little pop-up thing and it throws audacity. Um... So I actually bought the original Harvest Moon for Super Nintendo and I need to play it. I don't know, I'm just being lazy. I don't know why, I feel like I don't have to be all the physical games I own, but Digital ones are kind of, like, eh. Of course, mostly the games I buy digital are older RPGs, and RPGs take forever. Yeah. If you... I generally hate buying digital games unless they're old enough that they have problems with save batteries, because let's all remember that games used to save the batteries, and... Once the battery dies, your game kind of goes kaput. So yeah, it's kind of nice being able to actually play those. Um, but... I refuse to get digital games unless they're free. I call get free games from Club Nintendo occasionally. For actual games that are being put on cartridges, because... Generally, I haven't had a problem at all with any DS cartridge. Yeah. That's actually one reason I hope that Friends of Mineral Town comes out on the virtual console for either 3DS or Wii U, even though I prefer 3DS. Um, Friends of Mineral Town actually saved to a battery, and I actually want to play through it again, but I don't want to lose my stupid save file, because I think my battery has passed away. I'm not sure. Audacity, are you drunk? Yeah. Oh well. Okay. Just look around. You know, strangely, this was actually my routine on on the beginning for a while too. Just take care of any crop work, take care of my animals go up into the mountains, pick up anything and everything I can, go socialize, and yeah, that's actually still my routine to this day. You know, in the beginnings, mine was actually a lot nicer than this one. I, I talked about the one in this one earlier, but in the new beginning, it was actually nice because there weren't a hundred floors of terror, and that was a weird glitch. I'm not gonna lie. Um, Sorry, I get distracted very easily. Um... Now in... A new beginning, you just save in front of... One of them. And... One of the mi few mining spots. Just pretty much ex mine until you got like 5 to 10 items, see if what you got. If you didn't like any of them, just reset. And you can go on for a while just doing that. Ugh, well, fun and joy. We're not gonna chop up the shipping box as much as we want to. Let's go talk to Woody. I wanna see how much a 
fun cost to build. Alright, so it's gonna be under new construction. Yeah. So barns 40 pieces and 3500 gold, we have 14 pieces. Um Yeah, okay, that shouldn't be too bad. Okay, upgrading to a level two house is gonna be kind of Oh, that's just building it. Huh. Okay. So I guess that means we're gonna go behind Mr. Dolphin. Uh. Yeah, I'm... Once you befriend Mr. Dolphin, he'll take you to an island where fishing gets you very nice fish. And our quest for lumber continues. Okay, come on, Mr. Fish. You know, this game actually reminds me a lot of Animal Crossing fishing, but this game's actually merciful. I can actually say that because I got the Golden Rod in multiple Animal Crossing games. And that fish is called a Carol. What? No, Mr. Dolphin doesn't love us yet. Oh well. He'll love us one day. And I think I'm just gonna spend the rest of the day fishing. <sighs> At least this game's Animal Crossing. Yeah, Animal Crossing got very picky when it came to fishing. Especially when you get bigger fish like the sharks. And the coral camp. Or seal camp. Koala camp. Or koala camp. However you want to pronounce it. Nobody knows the correct pronunciation of that word. Not even me. All I know is it's a rare fossil fish in Animal Crossing and Curio and Touch My Katamari. Think fishing really gets you much money until we unlock the island. This reminds me, we need to go to the lake at some point. Okay, game. That was pink, not silver. I thought that was the silver trout at first, and then. Hey, silver. I thought like that was a. What is it? Red snapper or red carp or whatever at first? Okay, just a few more fish, and we'll be good to go. And we got ourselves a girl. Okay, just keep fishing. Press that back. So we're just gonna go ahead and ship these and then I'll cut off, so... Generally next time, we... Just continue on with preparations for getting our barn built. And then there's the Egg Festival coming up on the 8th, so that should actually be the next episode. Huh. Alright, until then.